match from Stardom Supreme Fight 2024, the 13th anniversary show, was a tag team match that featured the return of the one and the only, the former World of Stardom champion, red belt holder, Tam Nakano. Boy, have the fans been pining for this. And here she is teaming with Yuna Mizumore to take on Mina Shirakawa and Waka Tsukiyama which is an interesting story here. They all used to be buddies and friends and associates. That was sort of a, a unit, the Cosmic Angels, which still exist, of course. And they were sort of teamed up, sort of the B fraction of that unit, if that makes any sense, called Venus, which included Waka Tsukiyama and, of course, Mina Shirakawa. So we know that um, Mina and Waka are now in an XB with... Um, the heavyweight champion, the, the world of stardom champion, Micah and uh, Hanako. So, not really a blood feud here, but there's some tension, or always been some tension, between Mini Shirakawa and Tam Nakano. They faced off with the white belt in the past. They, they've, they have a sordid story, good, bad, and everywhere in between. So, that's why this tag team matchup was made. Mina and Tam have a long, sordid story. Uh, but not, I wouldn't call them bitter enemies. It's, it's just I have to watch Stardom to understand it. There's some friction. There's some professional envy there. There's a lot of stuff. And this match was pretty good. Now, Adam, how could you say pretty good? You just typed up the return of the mighty Tam Nakano. Yes, but I, she was put on a tag team here, to, in my opinion, to ease back into it. Tam is one of the most physical wrestlers in the world. All the bigger she is, she will do some of the craziest spots. And I don't just mean high fly. She's got like a, a Steiner screwdriver. Uh, I forget what she calls it, the purple screwdriver or something like that. That's just out of this world, wicked and bad. She did not perform it here. That's one of my favorite moves in wrestling. The Steiner screwdriver is my absolute favorite. Tam's version is one of my favorites. That doesn't look quite as brutal. Of course, nobody does when compared to Scott Steiner. Um, but she didn't pull it out here, but I didn't really expect her to. This was sort of her way to ease back in. The match was good. Wasn't as stiff as a lot of matches. Wasn't as tight and snug as a lot of matches. But it wasn't bad. It was a solid tag team effort here to feature the return of Tam Nakano. Yuna Mizumori looked good using her strong moves, you know, her clotheslines and what have you like she does. Mina Shirakawa is the most courageous wrestler in the world. She will step up to anybody. I got this 40-pound dog, and I, no, I'm not comparing her in a negative way to a dog. Bear with me. I got this 40-pound cattle dog. I mean, which 40 pounds isn't dainty, but it isn't big. And... She thinks she's the toughest dog in the world. She would fight a pit bull. She would probably fight a cougar. She doesn't care. She doesn't really like other animals. She wants to prove that she's the alpha dog in every situation. And she will, she loves people, but she will take off on any dog, no matter the size. And that spirit puts me in the mind of Mina Shirakawa. She doesn't care. She will step to anyone. She will fight anyone, no matter their size, no matter their experience, no matter their championship, no matter where they're from, what league, what company, what country, what have you. And that is a great mixture when you put her in there with Tam Nakano. And that's what we saw here. But we know Waka. Look, I love Waka. English speaking, a uh, really attractive woman, really pretty solid wrestler for the most part. She's far from the greatest, but she's solid or she wouldn't be in stardom. She's here to eat the pin. That's what she does. Tam Nakano takes her out and pins her one, two, three for the victory for her and Yuna Mizumori. In an emotional return, they speak to the crowd afterward. Tam does. I don't know what she's saying. You'll see that in Stardom World when it goes up with subtitles. I'm sure she's just thanking everybody and tickled pink to come back. And I'm sure before long, we'll see Tam Nakano in the hunt for the red belt. That's pretty much for sure.